So guys, you accidentally delete your precious photos, your contacts gone, your safari history gone, your messages gone, and you want to recover that back. Well, you came to the right video. I'm going to show you guys how to recover that data right back onto your device or maybe even your computer. This is going to be on all my iPhone videos for the most part, most videos. Um, first things first, you will need a computer. Now, I'm going to be using my MacBook. Oh, it's kind of dirty. I didn't make sure it was clean. No, no, this is the design. It's, it's a vintage look. Okay. You will need a computer, whether it's Mac or Windows. It will work. I got some stickers on my laptop. No, well, this is a sticker from Slick Wraps. But I'm talking about like a real thing. And most importantly, you will need a stable USB connection, lightning or 30 pin. Just make sure it's MFI certified so you don't have any issues down the road. But um, yeah, without further ado, let's recover this data. Let me just show you guys my photos. I have nothing on my photos application. And just to show you guys, I have no photos. Um, so no photos here, as you guys can see, empty. Um, and this is a used iPhone, so I'm gonna probably see all kinds of photos here. Um, contacts, I don't wanna show you guys that. My Safari, I cleared out all my Safari history. I have all my bookmarks, everything is going here. But I'm gonna show you guys how to recover those photos though. Uh, so first things first, you connect your iOS device. And by the way guys, this will work on the iPod Touch and the iPad, so keep that in mind. And of course, you guys are gonna be zoomed into the screen like about now. First things first, you will need to download this application right here. It is called Phone Rescue. And yes, you wanna rescue your phone. You wanna definitely get all your data back. So very, very nice animation there. And it's gonna prompt you with these tips. So make sure your phone is on airplane mode. Make sure you kill all the applications running in the background. So I'm gonna do all that right now. I'm just gonna enable airplane mode, right? Make sure all my apps are closed. That's correct. And my USB connection is stable. So that's about right. All right, so now you can check this box so it doesn't show you again. And then now you're gonna be selecting uh, which recovery mode to get started. So you have recover from iOS device. And even tell you on the bottom right corner, uh, common scenario, so lost data forgot passcode screen is damaged so your screen is all messed up you want to recover your data and then you can see what's on the device and then you can get your new phone or repair your phone and then you have your data with you so kind of like this is like a you know what I mean this is like a plan B always back up your phone before anything and I'm gonna get to that in a little bit this last one here is fairly handy iOS repair tool so if you're if you jailbroke your device you're stuck on the boot loop you're stuck on the Apple logo you can also uh, kick your device back into the um, iOS or back into your home screen. Um, so it's gonna fix that. So first things first, let's recover from iOS device. That's the, is the first step. And we're gonna scan by clicking this arrow. And then you can actually select which data you want. I'm actually gonna leave everything selected, but just to show you guys, you have your photos, you have your music, your voice memo, your app video, you guys see everything on screen. There's a lot of data that you can recover. So that's always handy. And while that thing is scanning, I actually see the sync logo on the top of my iPhone here. So you guys can see. So yeah, it's the little twirly thing. So make sure you see that so it's definitely scanning. And of course, it depends how much data you have in your iPhone. Um, the more data you have, the slower this will take. But this is a fairly bare bones uh, device. So as you guys can see, my Safari history is here. So anything that's in red, that means I deleted it. So all the history, like I said, I deleted them earlier. So everything here is deleted. I have all my bookmarks, so I didn't delete none of my bookmarks. So they, so they appear black, right, with the black text. Now if I go into photos, so remember, you guys saw earlier, I don't have no photos on my camera roll. I can even show you guys again. So camera roll, no photos or videos, and this is what it found. now. I don't know these pictures. I haven't took these pictures. So, yeah, I, I don't know. Like I said earlier, this is a used iPhone. So, you're going to find some, some you know what I mean, some pictures. You have thumbnails. So, these thumbnails, I believe these are like the thumbnails of the um, of the video or thumbnails of the photos. You can select what you want to get back on your device. So, now this icon, this is going to definitely put your photos back onto your device. Or you can save them on your computer, which is very, very handy. I'm going to save it on the... Oh, wait. Oh, you got to turn off find my iPhone too? Okay. Okay, so if you want certain items, you will need to restart your device. And yes, it did. So as you guys can see, 
Recovery completed. So now let's put it to the test. Now, yes. All right, let's go into our photos. All right, what the hell? Where is it? Oh, there, there we go. Wait. It only recovered two. Wait, hold on. Why did it only recover two? It only recovered two photos? I selected more than two. Damn, this one getting hot too. Damn, man, what the fuck is good with this shit, man? All right, I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to scan again. I'm having some trouble here. All right, guys, I apologize. I didn't end out this video properly. Um, basically, um, I tried out a different software called DBack, and it's pretty much the same exact thing. Um, trying to recover these photos. Um, and it's it's the same exact thing you have um, at photos. It's just nothing new at all and Lesson learned the best thing to do back of your phone via iCloud or iTunes and you'll be okay um, This is treat this as a plan B. This is not going to work effectively all the time um, Maybe if you want to get contact something light I think it might work because look it, it's showing some photos, but not all of it. So yeah So, you know, this is just like a plan B. So I can't say this thing is a hundred percent BS or a scam But uh, you know, it's just definitely not um, It's not what I thought. I thought it would recover the whole entire thing, but I guess not um, So yeah, I mean download it try it out for yourself You can download the trial version before you actually purchase and see if it actually will cover your photos You can actually preview it and if you want to get the photos back on your device, you have to pay for the software to get it back on there. Alright guys, that pretty much concludes today's video. Um, I'm sorry for this, you know, lazy, lazy work. I know the background messed up and all that, but hey, it is what it is. Subscribe if you haven't already with notifications on. Drop a like on this video if you did find this video helpful. And other than that, your boy Pops. And I catch you guys on the next video. And sorry for the inconsistent uploads. I really do apologize. Deuces.